What's good YouTube? We're back with another video. It's Wednesday morning. I just had breakfast. I'm outside currently. My little brother over there. Hey Randy. Go make a go. Hey, where you mad? You shy? What happened? Look guys, I have them in diapers so you can show off the quads and the calves. Hi huh, Randy. Go make a go, make a go, make a go. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Go. All right, back inside from playing with my brother. Now we're gonna get ready. This is gonna be our fit for today. We got the official trim for fit, all white, double waisted shorts, the aesthetic waistband right here, and we got the Young LA stringer, code Andrew for Young LA and code Drew for Train for Fit. So this is my go-to pre-workout drink. Well, we got one scoop of this pre-workout right here, not too heavy in caffeine, more stimulants than caffeine. And then we just got a scoop of creatine. You can either take your creatine before or after the workout, but you only need five grams. And if you didn't know, most, most protein sources do contain creatine like chicken or lean red meat. So you don't need so much of that. What day is it, homie? It's chest day, bro. Chest day. Chest day about to go down. Take some Rice Krispies for the pump. Got you one, bro. Thanks, man. Oh, shit. 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 We're just gonna get age restricted. Why? Because he gives it. You get a scoop, mate. A dry scoop for the video. Nah, I like to taste my pre. These little things, I only need like 90 calories and they're so small. But honestly, not worth it. 80 calories? 90. 90? Give me a sick pump. What's that with? Incline? Dumbo? Mm. Or flat? What did we start with last time? Well, last time we started with. Flat bench. Incline dumbbells. Remember guys, always switch it up. Especially if you get tired of doing the same workout over and over. Always switch up the routine so you won't get bored. But we got our pre-workout in. Now let's head in there and let's go kill this chest pump. Besides to warm up, we're gonna do some low cable flies to warm up upper chest. Coming straight. Sets, we're gonna do 12 to 15 with super lightweight. Okay, we're in a incline bench, start off light, and we're gonna work our way up.
we're moving on to this chest press machine. Make sure the seat is adjusted right here. Around next to your shoulder or a little bit lower. So you're gonna stick your chest out, clean your shoulders back, squeeze right here. So post chest day, we just got some pollo loco right here since we haven't had time to go shop for groceries. Remember guys, this is a lifestyle. It's not just about chicken and rice. It's about feeding your macros on a daily basis. Pollo loco, as you guys already know, has grilled chicken with some carbs, rice and beans. That fits mine and my dad's daily lifestyle. It's not, like I said, it's not chicken and rice. You don't have to hate your diet. Stick to something that you're gonna be able to stick to for the rest of your life. And also remember to keep track of how much you're having, especially your protein. That's really important. All right, so it's time to finally eat our post-workout meal. Chicken breast, rice, beans, and tomato. As you can see, I only did a small portion of rice and a small portion of beans mixed in together. That's enough calories. And I'm having a lot of protein. Protein is the main priority. So we just finished that meal. That meal was roughly about 500 calories, mainly pure protein though. But what I wanted to talk about is a lot of you guys asked me too about binge eating and what are some healthy snacks that I recommend. And for me personally, this is just my opinion. I don't really like to binge eat a lot because I know throughout the day I'm just gonna keep eating and eating and those calories will eventually add up and since I'm cutting, they, they won't leave me in a deficit. But I have this from time to time. I have veggie chips. Uh, these chips are made out of like, like real veggies like spinach, broccoli, even potatoes. But you can't, it doesn't taste like actual veggies. It just tastes like a regular potato chip. The macros aren't that bad. I make sure I only have like, if I do like four to five pieces, not that much. And then next one, next one is a favorite. Rice cakes, super low in calories. Uh, the unflavored ones are about like 30 calories, but I like to get the caramel or the chocolate ones, which are like 50 calories. Greek yogurt is another good snack, but I don't have that right now. I usually eat that as well, but those are my three main snacks, four with the Greek yogurt. Just remember, if you're going to have snacks like this, make sure to track them and make sure the calories are low. Because like I said, they can add up extremely quick. And you're not, when you think you're going to be in a deficit, you're actually going to be in a surplus. But that's going to do it for today's video. If you guys did enjoy this vlog, make sure to drop a like, a comment, and sub for some more fire content. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.